to another video man and today we have tupac hit him up original version uh y'all was telling me in the comment section box down below the uh uh y'all was telling me that there was an original version to this it was an og version hopefully this is the right one uh as lyrics so you know yeah it's featured a, a whole bunch of people uh Gaddafi. I think that's that light skinned boy. That's that boy I said I like. He had the second best verse in the original, uh, in the original one. Uh, EDI, uh, Huss Hussin, uh, Napoleon. Uh, who the freak is Italy? Ital. Who the freak is Ital and Storm? You feel me? Uh, but yeah, that's that's the outlaws. I don't know why they just didn't say the outlaws. Uh. But somebody, I, I'm looking at the comments. Somebody said, definitely sounds like a rough draft. It's hard, but don't get me wrong. But the original version really outdid this one. No cap. But, you know, uh, we're going to see we gonna see what uh, they're talking about on here. We're going to see if it's better than the original version. Or if not, I'm going to leave a link in the, to my reaction to the original version to the music video. You feel me? So, you know, uh, without further ado, y'all make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, turn on the post notification bell to be notified every time I drop a video. Let's see what they talking about on here. Oh my god oh my god hold on he said i heard they call you big papa how you figure because to me you'll always be a phony fat and <laughs> like nah hold up he was like hope you made hope you made a little money while the funk lasted basically he said i hope you made a little money while i was in jail while you made who shot you while who shot you came out and it was big for you i hope you enjoyed the money that you made you feel me it's not worth your life brother but you know i'm gonna keep it real i think tupac and biggie have one of the most saddest rap game stories like of all time those were like those are like the first time a big rapper two of the biggest rappers had died like from gun violence that that i think i don't know you gotta think before easy died to a disease you feel me biggie and tupac was shot and killed like that's and it was young like that's like the saddest i think they had the saddest stories like that stuff made me emotional like when i listened to that until the end of time album like that album really just it it, it makes me want to cry bro i don't know why it makes me want to cry though because it's just like it's pot like he was really changing he was really gonna take over for real like he was already taking over but like he was gonna take over the 2000s too it seemed like like what's going on like i don't know it, it's just sad and biggie he was younger he was 24. He was 24 and it was a little, and it seemed like he played this, I don't know if he played this innocent role or it looked like he was just genuinely scared, but like he didn't want to move like he was scared. But you could tell he was scared after what happened to Pop. Like he was paranoid for sure. And it's just sad how, how the rap game is now because now rappers is dying left and right, left and right. It's normal for a rapper to die to gun violence nowadays, which is sad to say. But, you know, they had two of the saddest, saddest stories. They didn't have to go out the way they did, especially Pac. Pac got, sho got shot in, in total like nine times. He had nine bullets in him. One in the head at that. Well, he got grazed in the head, but... He got hit in the head. He got he, he got hit nine times. Went to jail for for a crime he didn't do. In a short amount of time, he was in like three movies. Dropped like seven albums. <laughs> Come on now, Biggie. He wrote he wrote like six albums. Well, he wrote five albums. Dropped two of them at twenty four. This brother. <sighs> Come on now. Those fucking trash, right? And they know exactly who I'm talking about. Keep you all oh, bitch, man, niggas. Cause uh, niggas talk pretty shit. So many chips, I fucked your bitch, cause I'm through the list. When it's the hit, you talk bad about a nigga when I got blasted. Hope you made a little money while I fuck last year. Heard they call your big papa, nigga, I ain't figure. Cause to me, you always be a pretty fat nigga. I can't be cut for these women from socks, nigga. You run a rough, scared, yeah, fuck with the girls and bust. Now niggas talk, I got a little play at eight of the face. He said you crawl 
cross eyed it. Down syndrome crack. What the world? That's crazy. I never realized that. He said, he said, who shot me? Because Biggie made a song called Who Shot Ya? He said, Who shot me? He's answering, he's answering the question. Who shot me? But you punks didn't finish. Now you about to fit a rapper with minutes. We hit him up. You feel me? It's a different beat. Same, same verses right here, though, for sure. <laughs> Hold up, Napoleon. I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm gonna um, I'm, I'm gonna put you at the number three spot so far. I'm, I'm all right. We we gonna rate it like this. Pac. So far, he's number one. So so far, Pac's number one. Feel me? It seemed like. Pac was more so joking on there. I feel like Hit Him Up, the original version that came out, was more so personal. Like, it was a straight shot. This one, it was like he was playing around. Like, you feel me? And I'm glad he came out with the original version. Not saying this is bad. Not saying this is bad. Napoleon, I'm going to have you at the number three spot so far. Number three. You got EDI right here. Let's see. Nah, this brother, how he's rapping? Nah, Napoleon, you're going to number four. I'm going to keep it a buck with you. Pac one, EDI number two so far. He, he's number two so far. Let's keep it a buck with you. <laughs> Started up the uh the the original one. Get out the way, yo. Get out the way, yo. Yeah, Biggie Smalls just got shot. Better move past the Mac and let me hit him in his back. Yeah, I know. Come on now, <laughs> nah. I off rip. I like his original verse better. But you know, it, he kept that first part though. That's what I like though. That's tough. <laughs> Um, we're gonna give you originally we gave you I think we gave you the third best verse on the original one the EDI boy he got number two he got number two uh Napoleon he got number four 
uh you i'm gonna give you the fifth slot fifth slot for sure i'm gonna give you the fifth slot even though your verse was kind of the same but the edi boy and napoleon they're new they're new so you know we you 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 gotta go down to the fifth spot get, get in the back of the bus buddy uh Qaddafi, rpu man i think you're the light-skinned brother with the braids i saved the number three spot for you Please don't make me regret it. If not, Napoleon going to number three. Come on now, let's see. Gaddafi, what's going on? That was the shortest verse I heard you ever had, man. What's going on? You you going to the fourth spot. Napoleon, you up number three. Tupac, EDI, Napoleon, Gaddafi, and the H boy, Storm. Let's see what you're talking about. Let's get it. If your big bad motherfucker comes step to Storm a girl? I got points in the clips and rhymes up the clips who won't attest that In the one, two, three pounder band They get their ass put under Cause the soul's bringing nothing but thunder That's right Who's the bomb nigga put the fill that empty finger Situation number nine Now who's the bigger trigger I post a true G You thought I was bitch easy Now you're on your knees begging me Alright Storm uh, You're going You're going number six Prince Prince it Italy Joe Hey listen Off rip I don't know what you saying Hoofy broke broke on a, on a fever rich rich what's going on you might have number six off i mean number seven off rip what's going on nigga put the fill that empty finger situation number nine and who's the bigger trigger i post a true g you thought i was bitch easy now you're on your knees begging me woofy broke broke and woofy rich rich oh god immortal will never switch yeah you you going number seven brother you i don't you going number seven it's from the boy that my snitch Radical party, yes, we have talk like that. Jamaican party, yes, we love to crack. Warrior black, yes, the youth don't smoke crack. New York on a better respect to crack. Caddy, you big, and I'm proud to be black. Jealousy, some are gonna act like idiots. And in Panicana, some of them smoke crack. Tupac, I think I can land that. Man, that's, um, that's, that's Tupac hit him up. That's the original version. Uh, my boy, Italy. Ital, Prince Ital, you mean you number seven. You feel me? So Tupac number one, EDI number two. EDI went absolutely insane. I don't even know who that brother is, but that boy went dumb. That boy went dumb. Dumb. <laughs> if, if Tupac wasn't on, he was number one. So Tupac, EDI, Napoleon, Gaddafi, that H boy, Storm, and Italy. You feel me? I know that's not how you say his name, but hey, I don't know how to say his name. I'm going to keep it a buck with you. But that's my rating. You feel me? Y'all let me know who had the best verse, who got top three verses. Gaddafi, I was expecting more. But good thing that version didn't come out. The original one, I mean, not good thing the original one didn't come out. The one that we all know came out. And you had the second best verse. By, I wish EDI, why Pac take EDI out though? EDI. Man, EDI went absolutely insane. Pac, you're tripping. Why you take that brother off the song? What is you doing? <laughs> you feel me? But you know, y'all comment down below. Y'all tell me which version y'all like more. I wish I could take some, like, like I wish I could take EDI verse and put it in the original, like the one that we all know. Feel me? That's the only thing I like. Like I would give this, I, I give hit him up a ten. That the the one that we all know, but I'm gonna give this one. It gotta be lower. I'm gonna give it like a nine point nine point seven nine point seven. Cause you feel me, EDI really carried. I'm gonna keep it a buck with you. Pac, he was bidding. He was joking. He he. You feel me? He was frying. He was frying people. You mean like he was just cracking jokes, talking about some you cross eyed down syndrome. You fat boy. Uh, you fat. You mean like he he's talking about they call you Big Papa, but you a fat phony. Yeah, you a phony. 
uh, fat, yeah, like he was going absolutely insane, you mean? But like I said in the beginning of the video, I'm gonna leave the original version reaction to the music video and the link in the description. And y'all, I'm gonna leave my Instagram in there. Y'all go follow me on Instagram. Y'all make sure you like, comment, subscribe, turn on the post notification. Better be notified every time I drop a video, man. See y'all in the next one. Hope y'all enjoy. Hey, hey, hey.